Having cheated his way to the last round of the competition, Reagan finds himself face to face with Sands, who got there by doing literally nothing. Although Reagan has an early lead, he decides if he wants to clinch this, he's going to have to collude with his competition. He is surprised when Sands, who was entered into the competition unwittingly by his brother, he didn't know what the competition was for, is glad to help him win free of charge. They both run a series of debates where Reagan dismantled Sands by proving how utterly unattractive he is. As the debates continue, Reagan puts on boy band style makeup and works out to become extra attractive. However, mysteriously, Sands' vote only seems to be increasing despite this. Sands mentions that Reagan forgot that being unattractive is one of the key tenets of becoming a popular guy on Tumblr. Emotionally crushed that he possibly ever wasn't actually attractive at all, Reagan considers falling out of the competition. However, he is cheered up by Mob, who says that Reagan should remember what he taught him. He should have confidence regardless of what anyone thinks of him. On the final day of the campaign, Reagan shows up with rings under his eyes, a five o'clock shadow, and a dad bod. Without saying anything, he takes out a sandwich on stage and stuffs it into his mouth. He follows up with his special attack, putting his fingers in his mouth like that one picture of Peter from Spider-Verse. The audience cheers, and Reagan's polling makes a massive comeback. In the end, the results are revealed. Sands won by a single vote. Reagan can't believe it. One vote? How did he lose by one vote? Even that stupid skeleton voted for him. Mob shows up and says offhandedly that since Tumblr sexy men are unattractive, he wanted Reagan to have self-confidence, not rely on what other people think of him. Therefore, he voted for Sands. I don't know how to feel about this. <laughs>